Even today, these images are not a normal sight. Skiing and snowboarding on actually only one leg, thanks to constantly further developed, sophisticated high technology. An amputation stops a normal life abruptly. Modern prosthesis can compensate for what the lost leg has taken. The goal has to be to lead a normal life, at least to a large extent, despite the amputation. And often enough, sports become more important. Ambitiously prosthesis manufacturers want to restore normality. Modern tools go to extremes, high-tech materials, electronically controlled, optimally damped, but also very light in weight. For instance, at Otto Bock in Duderstadt in Lower Saxony, the technical masterpieces are produced, with high demands on the production technology. Precision, particularly in the field of prosthetics, is required in virtually all components of the exoprosthesis. If you imagine that the requirements for the components are extremely high, in their life cycle they will be strained and let loose several million times at a very high dynamic rate. At the same time, we have restrictions concerning the weight of these components and must also anatomically perceive the shape given to us by nature. The most modern machine tools are used here. Very precisely, they work repeatedly in order to meet the requirements of prosthesis wearers. Each piece must be manufactured absolutely precisely, just as planned. This way, operability and durability aim to be secured. A prosthesis consists of up to 500 different parts. They are all perfectly coordinated and work together, at normal strain, but also in extreme situations. The more intricate these designs are, the more delicate the geometries are, also generally the higher the requirements for the control technology of these machines are. Today modern prosthetic systems have up to 24 sensors with the corresponding controls. The signals are read, interpreted and then converted into actions within the prosthesis system. The artificial limbs cope with winter sports, if need be, on a high-level performance. At the Paralympics in Sochi, not only athletes will prove what they can do, also the modern prosthetic technology will once again have to show what they are capable of.